Yeah, yeah, this is how we do it in the Central Coast, man. We got 40 ounces, old English, rag tops, six foreign collars, and bikini girls, man. This is how we do it on the West Coast. San Diego, San Francisco, Los Angeles. But don't forget about the Central Cali, man. Please don't forget about the Central Cali. Yeah, get them. It's another sunny day in the state of California Low water palm trees, them G's that put it on ya This ain't a negative, we speaking in bonnets Rag talk, candy paint on these with hydraulics Baseball hat with the sticker on the ring Don't let the shine blind your sight cause things can get real But I'm not here to talk about banana clips and guns We're going back to Cali and we're gonna have some fun A West Coast domination And welcome back to Two-Face Heavy Captain Podcast I am your host Fred Segura, out here in Monterey County, also known to the world as the Salad Bowl, also known as the Salinas Valley. To the people in L.A., we are north. To the people in San Francisco, we are south. Right smack in the middle, best of both worlds. Don't forget about the Central Kelly. Anyway, folks, today we are going to talk about excuses and boundaries, putting putting uh, walls from what, you know, you know, putting up walls with each other, right? Um, and, and, and you know what? It, it may, it, this can go in many different directions, guys, but I'm going to stick to, try to stick to one. Um, or we can visit a couple of them, either way, whichever way it goes. But check this out. Here, here's the deal. So, um, what I mean by that is, like, when somebody says, oh, well, you know, I need to get this done, right? And right away, we put ourselves in the mind frame of like, well, yeah, but see, I, I don't know, see, because I'm, you know, I'm whatever the situation is, you know what I mean? I'm not used to that or I'm not, you know, whatever, we're already putting a mental block to try to, uh, we're discouraging ourselves, right? That's one, that's one way of doing stuff. The other one is, guys, is excuses within ourselves. Oftentimes, guys, it's within race. Let's just put it that way, and I will say it. Sometimes we say, oh, well, it's because uh, I'm of this ethnicity or I'm of this race. This is why this is happening to me. You know, if we go back again to the 90s, uh, we focused a lot on the, the quote-unquote the man, right? The man, you know, and, uh, you know, you're working for the man or, you know, you're 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 being a... You know, you're bowing down to the man and so forth, which is the man is the, the government, I guess, whichever way it goes, right? It, it doesn't really matter. Um, you know, uh, being, say, for example, at a place of employment, uh, which I, I've been, uh, where technically, the you know, it's it's more of one race than the other, whatever like that. I've never looked at it as, oh, I'm, I'm outnumbered here, you know, or whatever the situation is. I'm there for one reason, for one reason only, to do my job. You know, I'm just there like everybody else. What we do at work is what we have to do, and we have to get it done. And we as co-workers, we can get it done and, and, and do a good job about it and go home and feel good about it, right? And get paid for it, as we should, right? What you do at your dinner table, at your coffee table, and how you really feel about things, that's beyond me, you know, or, you know, what I do, whatever the situation is, right? Um. But with that said, guys, also, too, it's like uh, some people play victim all the time to stuff. Oh, well, you know, it's because I'm, I'm of this race and I feel like this and I feel like that. It's like no, no, there's no, there's no excuses for it. Are there bad people in the world? Yes, there, yes, there is. There is bad people in the world. There are, you know, there are a lot of bad people in the world. And and you know what? Um, but I tend to look at things as more of a, of a. We control our own destiny. What we choose to do, how we choose to live, you know. Um, of course, there are things that are out of our control at times. So, I'm the type of person that tries not to worry about what's out of my control. What I can control is uh, the things that I can control. In other words, uh, I do it and I move on it. I, 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 you know, try to get things done, try to make things happen, you know, um, so on and so forth. 
but um to just sit there and 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 like oh and and do nothing for myself and 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 be like oh you know and feel sorry for myself oh well you know this and that like no and then and then turn around and, and blame it on race too as well again you know um and i say that because there's a lot of us that, that do that uh, and it's not just one particular race you know um even if we're we're um we categor categorize ourselves in certain things whatever race you are you categorize yourself you know some people tend to look at things like well you know, if you're a working person, this is what I refer to you as. If you're not, this is what I refer to you as. It's like, there's excuses for everything. Here's one thing. If a bad person tries to insult me or say something uh, negative towards me in a racial way and stuff like that, um, my thing is not to feed into it. My thing is not for them to let them get the best of me, burst my bubble, that kind of so on and so forth. Here's the thing. I went to school here, graduated here, was educated here, paid my taxes, have everything legit, thank God. Um, you know, I worked my way up to what I needed to get to. Right? We could sit there and complain about a lifestyle, complain about financial situations, complain about this and this and that, you know. And what I mean by that, guys, it doesn't mean that you're going to go, oh, wow, well, I don't have a mansion. I don't have this. I don't have that, you know. But what I'm talking about is appreciating what you do have, right? So when you work for something and you have it, hey, if it's paid for, it's paid for. You know, you, you paid it off. That's a plus be it your vehicle, be it your home, be it whatever it may be, right? So, sorry to ramble on a little bit, guys. Let me get back on track to what I'm getting at. So, in other words, that's what I mean. When you work your way up to something, you work it to to avoid the, the, the stress, right? Um, to be able to pay your bills, so on and so forth, right? Which is what we are, as humans, do. Um... But sometimes that's not good enough. People feel they're entitled to more, right? And they want better and they want more. That goes without saying. But for somebody to sit there and say, well, it's because I'm of this ethnicity and, 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 and I, this is what it is. I have to live in the ghetto. I have to live in the barrio. I have to live in whatever situation. No, you don't. No, you don't. And if you do, for whatever the reasons is, you make the best of it, as we do anywhere. You know, doesn't mean you have to, you know, uh, fall into those stereotypes. Uh, movies, again, like Boys in the Hood. Hence, that's what it is, you know. <coughs> Excuse me. That's what it is. But it showed a positive outlook that somebody from the hood can end up going to college. You know message but anyways um so that that's that's my that's my whole spill on, on this kind of situation uh to to feel like you know what like okay there's uh we are not all and not to say nothing bad we are not all gang members we are not all you know this kind of situations right um again i went to school i we i even went back to school I uh, I obtained a commercial driver's license, so on and so forth, to better oneself, right, for my family and I. That's the, the key thing. So when it comes to that kind of stuff, when you go through the test, you go through the, the physicals, uh, the, the phys medical physicals, uh, background checks, uh, so on and so forth, right? It's not just a, hey, I apply for that and, and let's see if I get it. No, you work for it. You work for it to obtain a job, to get to where you need to get to, to support your family. You don't sit there and say, oh, well, you know, uh, uh, it's because I'm of this race, so 
this is why things aren't happening. No, we got to make it happen. We got to get off our tails and make things happen. And that's where I'm getting at. You know what I mean? There's a lot of people in this world that, that will make excuses because of their race. And that's why things aren't happening for them. Uh, I don't care if you're short, tall, um, dwarfed, uh, skinny, fat, and or whatever size, whatever it is, all shapes and sizes, you know, you can, you can make something happen. You know, we come in all shapes and sizes and, and, and it can be done. That's just, a, that's just a fact of the matter. So, I mean, there, there's no reason to, to, to sit there and complain and, 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 and scream back at, at society to say, Hey, well, you know what, uh, the, you know, uh, uh, they, you know, the the police officer pulled me over because because I'm a I'm a I'm of this race and I'm driving this kind of vehicle. Well, maybe his tail light was out and he asked you simply, you know, let me see your your documents, right? Your driver's license, insurance, and and registration. Now, if you're gonna play the part and you're gonna start, you know, acting up towards it when it's just a simple, maybe it's a brake light, maybe it's you know, whatever it may be. Um, now you're in the wrong. It's not always about color. Is it is in 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 race? Does it happen? Yes, it does. Have I seen it happen? Yes, it does. Yes, it does. And I will say this: people sometimes, when when it comes to that kind of stuff, it's always oh, you know, the Caucasians get the bad the bad rap for it. I've been harassed by the officers of, of my own race. Um, but that's not to say all officers are bad, you know. But there's bad in every in, in every race. We're not all good. Just like we're not all gang members, uh, all all the law enforcement is, is not good, but there are good good people out there. Um, so on and so forth. Doctors, teachers, you know, whatever the case may be. Right, there's good, there's bad. It's just how it goes. But to sit there and make an excuse because of your race, no, maybe it's you because you're not doing what you're supposed to be doing to make your your life at least a little bit better. Right? So, that's really it, guys. Uh, don't make excuses. Don't Pull the race card. Don't feel like, oh, I'm outnumbered and, and I'm this and that. No. We make our life. We make our own decisions. And if we want better, we do better. As we should. You know. And if we can't get to something, for whatever the reason may be, we make the best of what we have. That's just life. With that, this is Two-Face Entertainment Podcast. I'm your host. Fred Segura, signing out. Shake the piss sucker streets and we rollin' Why you so mad? Why you so serious? Shit in my rear view like a slow and delirious Keep on mashing, getting plenty action The home of the G's and pimps, I love it with a passion Throw it up, it's California, I ate Where the sun lays to rest like every day The home of the color rag, swap meets and bangers Chuck Taylor's lows and them real dope slangers This is reality, it's where I stay Along the Pacific in the state of CA Golden State from Frisco to Compton and back to Central Cali where the party keeps rocking. It's a California state of mind and you can't be mad, that's just how we rock. Golden State. Saying that I'm greedy, but hip hop is skinny. So what the hell do you expect from me? It's the passion, I finally understand it. I'm hiding in the trees like a male praying mantis, searching for my prey. God, please come and bless me, help relieve my stress so I don't worry about death. Never said I was leaving, but dreaming on like Stephen. Fallen angel, I'm Zeppelin, not ready for heaven. So please tell me, is there another way? So I can look up in the sky and say thank you for these better days. One, two, man, it's coming for you. Three, four, better lock your doors. Five, six, hit a pop with a twist. Seven, eight, please don't hate. One, two, things coming for